In today's tutorial, I'll show you how to install Bliss OS on your PC as a complete replacement for Windows without using a USB drive or DVD. This guide will cover each step from downloading Bliss OS to setting up your PC to boot directly into it. So, let's get started. First, head to the official Bliss OS website at blissos.org. You'll find various versions available, 14, 15, 16, and Zenith. Since version 16 is still in beta and Zenith isn't recommended for daily use, we'll download version 15 for this setup. Once the ISO is downloaded, you are ready to move to the next step. Go to your Downloads folder. Locate the ISO file, right click and select Mount. This will mount the ISO as a virtual drive on your computer. Next, open Disk Management. We need to create a small partition to store the ISO contents. Right click on the C drive, select Shrink Volume, Create a 4GB partition for the ISO. Format this partition as FAT32 and label it ISO. Now, go back to the virtual drive. Copy all the ISO contents and paste them into the new partition. After this, you can right click the virtual drive and select eject to unmount it. We'll use this ISO partition as the Bliss OS bootable USB. To make sure your PC recognizes this ISO partition in the boot menu, we need to convert it to an EFI system partition. Open command prompt as administrator. In the command prompt, type disk part and press enter. Type list disk and press enter. Select the main disk containing the ISO partition. This is usually disk 0. Type list partition and press enter. Select the partition you created for the ISO, which should be around 4 GB. Now, to set the partition ID to EFI, type help set ID. The GUID is specifically for EFI system partitions, so copy it. Then, type set id equals to and paste the copied GUID. This step makes the ISO partition bootable in the BIOS. To confirm the changes, type list partition again. You should now see the partition listed as an EFI system partition. Now, restart your computer and enter the boot menu. You should see the ISO partition is detected as a bootable device. Select the UEFI option to boot into the Bliss OS installer. In the Bliss OS menu, choose Bliss OS installation. On the next screen, it will ask where to install Bliss OS. Choose the Create or Modify Partitions option. This will open the CF Disk Partition Manager. Here. Delete all the Windows partition to free up space for Bliss OS. Now, we'll need to create two partitions with the available free space, an EFI system partition for boot purposes and a Linux partition for the Bliss OS installation. Select New, then create a 1GB partition. Set its type as EFI system. 
this will be used as the boot partition. Now with the remaining space, create a new primary partition and set its type as Linux file system. We'll install BlissOS in this partition. After creating both the partitions, write partition table. Type yes to confirm. And then quit to exit CF disk. With the partition set up, we are now ready to install BlissOS. First, select the EFI partition to install the boot files. This is usually the partition one that we just created. Format it as FAT32. Next, select the second partition and format it as ext4. Name this partition BlissOS for easy identification in the boot menu. BlissOS gives you two bootloader options, GRUP and Refined. Since we are setting up BlissOS as the only operating system, GRUP is the recommended choice here. Select GRUP and continue with the installation. After installation, reboot your PC. If it all goes smoothly, your PC will boot directly into BlissOS. And there you have it, you have successfully installed BlissOS on your PC without a USB drive, fully replacing Windows. If this tutorial was helpful, please like, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more tech guides. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.